Hello, uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. It's time for more Europe in Yourselves Rome. I'm your host, Galvin. Just taking a moment here to just admire the Alps. Like, the, there are a few things this game does quite well. And mountains, you know, for what, for what it's got to work with, does, like, the Alps astoundingly well. Hmm. It's actually kind of neat. Anyway, where were we? Right. Um, welcome back to European Rosales Rome. I'm your host, Kelvin, and today we continue our conquest against the Egyptian rebels as they start to fall apart, and we're going to try and scavenge whatever provinces we can from them. So we're heading for Cyprus next. Barbarians and all right, yeah, yeah, sure. Apparently, we had troops there already. Anyway, good. Alright, with any luck we'll get some more absorptions and everything will be fine. Yeah, it looks like and Rome's now declared war on the Egyptian rebels. I should potentially uh, send an expedition into North Africa. I need to block the Romans. Because they aren't going to get it from anywhere else. And I sure as heck don't want them getting a foothold in Northern Africa. Rome right now is my biggest threat. I would say it's Carthage, but uh, I'm working on becoming friends with Carthage, so, you know. going to be tough to work with. Land Tech 7, eh? Am I ahead of them on that? I feel like I'm ahead on them on that. Hugely ahead. So, no, can I get anyone better for that? Like, I've got to have somebody better, yeah? Okay, good. Put him in charge. I want more land tax. Good. So that's a good advantage I can press over Rome at some point. Is my advantage in technology. Alright. First things first, though, we need to get Cyprus. Um, get those guys to a coast immediately. Okay, go. Oh god, I forgot just how long it takes troops to march in this game. Okay, we have roads to deal with as well. Oh good, I'll, they managed to retake Alexandria. Oh, god, and everything else got built. Um, okay, so first things first, arrive in roads. Take care of that. You guys, okay, good. You guys got that as well. Excellent. Damn, we're too late. We're just too late. Civic technology emptied. Damn. Oh, well, we tried. We tried. At least we have all the islands we could ever ask for. <laughs> Ooh, you can trap a loyalist or two off. Or not loyalist, I mean. I want to get rid of anyone who isn't, uh... Oh, we have to do have a hetero eye in there. But whatever. We can get rid of pretty much everything we can. There's no way they're, uh, starting to take things back, are they? They might be. Okay. Agrians got that for wherever that's worth. Not much since the barbarian power is built up so high. 47.1, good. We need to get you on another trade route or something. Like with that, yeah. Okay. Good. So as I can trade it will uh, hopefully help. Yeah, there you go. Get yeah, loyal soldiers was a failure. Understood. But yeah, there's. I think the Egyptian rebels are just gonna lose out, if not because of Roman conquest, <laughs> because they lose the civil war. But I suppose this uh, helps set the stage for a uh, Carthaginian intervention. I mean, Carthage running out of other places to expand to. Eventually. 
<laughs> Has the mission break the Romans? What does it take? Oh, proclaim a guarantee. Get that out right away. Forgot about that. Um, it does expire eventually. So yeah, we're up to minus 64. I like it. So let's see. Any other trading we can do? No, I don't want diplomacy. We have a diplomat in route already. Whoops. Right. That's fine. What's going on in my realm? There seems to be a lot of rebellion. Let's see. We only have a governor considering independence in Macedonia, no less. He's got loyal units and all that. Damn. Any chance we can put him into, like, a tech office or something? Because I can go for that. Yeah, we can. All right. I mean, I don't mind that he's disloyal in a tech office. It's just going to be one of many. Not enough to start a civil war. Ah, uh, shoot. Yeah, it's better to put him in there. Put him in here. Put him in here. Put him in here. There we go. Shuffle around uh, the cabinet a bit. Most of everyone's loyal to me. Eh, it's fine. <laughs> we have enough loyalty that uh, one stray rebellious man isn't enough for me to care. Okay, slowly the rebel forts are falling. Won't take for won't take long now. I mean, like my war score is intrinsically just going up because I hold things. Huh. Sure, whatever. Bithynia thought to themselves it'd be a great idea. It'd be a great idea to try and become independents. <sighs> Is that, that, there's no way that was my whole navy, was it? Oh, fuck. Please tell me that was not my whole navy. Well, I know that thing's lying, but I don't know. It. Shit. I forgot. How atrocious attrition is in this game on navies. Okay, so good job, I think. Decline. Super peace, annex. Imprisonment and foreigners seek asylum. And now they need a new governor who isn't going to fuck shit up. You get some grain, some stone, some fish, and some horses. Good. Eh, whatever. Eastern Sound Hold again, excellent. And their navy just melted. So we do have the slight problem now we have a bunch of troops trapped on this island. And a bunch of troops trapped on this island. Well, luckily most of these will melt eventually. Because I need to get rid of them all. Uh, but we are going to need to build a lot more boats. Oh dear. Okay. Uh, recruit army, no. Build a navy. Let's build a dozen or so, or ten or whatever. Figure out the rest later. Well, it looks like the Egyptian rebels are more or less done. Good. I didn't even read that major discovery, I'm a dumbass, but whatever it is, it's good.
And our war score continues to go up. How long will they last? How long will they last? The rebels are burning before our very eyes. Agrons. And just three barbarians. 500 invest in land technology. I like it. Alright. Well, we have two horse hammers available. Uh, we have a mercenary regiment, but it's not available. Okay, three horse hammers. Good. So slowly, what remains here is going to fall apart. We hope. Oh, hey, we can colonize is I guess... Ah, you've uh, become able to colonize. In that case, colonize. Okay, my brain's taken care of. There we are. Uh, that's our first little... Uh... Okay, get there. Okay, we need, to, we need to put dudes around. We need to put dudes everywhere, because apparently there's a lot of barbarians. A refuge from Rome is seeking asylum. I guess Rome's not happy with the populace right now, huh? I like the Parthian League, really? Jeez. Alright, well, whatever. Fucking populists. Uh, okay, Barbarians defeated, good. Tyrus, you're up to 9.3 people, good. 47.7. Christ, fighting uh, the old Bia is gonna be tricky. A lot of barbarians. Never underestimate them. I really should read those major discoveries. <laughs> Forty-three percent. Like, eventually, what's left is gonna fall. This, <laughs> no doubt about it. All gonna be mine eventually. Thracia considers independence. Is that so? What's making you consider independence? In fact, you have loyal units. There are reasons to consider independence. But it's not happening. Okay. okay well, there's some grain in there, that's fine. Alright. I'm still concerned about Olba. Because, I mean, it's opening up yet another front with the Romans. I'm not keen on doing that. Like, the Romans can still kick my ass. Don't forget it. They are more powerful than I am. That's for sure. Uh, 62, good. In probably about 50 years, we can maybe force an alliance or something. Right, every decade or so, we have to send them a gift. <laughs> That's annoying. Because I can't deal with that because I lost my navy. Okay, do we have any other boats? Dear Egypt, hurry up and fucking win. The hell's taking so long. <laughs> they can't have that much left like to fight you with. Come on. <laughs> what what could they possibly have at this point? Alright. Let's see. I need a lot of uh I'll just use this. Building as many provinces as we can. Go. As many provinces as we can. Just build. Build a navy. Invoke an omen for population growth. Thank you. Yes. Invest a little more. That's fine. Uh, I can trust people. It's fine. And... Congratulations, your governor. Okay. 
So we need to get a bunch of ships together as quickly as possible. It'll hold out for a while. Uh, but damn, that's a lot of rebels. Rejected that peace offer. That's fine. Pergamon and Phygra. So, not the islands. Unacceptable. Yeah, invest some more. The state can handle it. We have a pretty decent balance since we uh, accidentally disintegrated our navy. Serious accident. <laughs> Alright, so Memphis looks like it's about ready to give. New monument, eh? That's a splendid idea. Okay. Old bill. Alright. And again there. Well, we'll have to deal with the barbarians there, but I can probably make arrangements. Okay. Now, all being considered, shouldn't take much to uh, antagonize these guys into fighting us. What is with the revolts? Just war exhaustion, huh? Yeah, my state isn't very stable, unfortunately. Can't take much war exhaustion. Okay, I think you lose. There we go. Wow, they rejected, huh? Alright, uh, I guess I don't get Cyprus. Like, maybe? And sure, why not? Walk away with those three. We can walk away with that. You know what, that's three whole new provinces. I'll take them. Okay, so what do we got along the lines of ships right now? We need a navy. Okay, this works. Just barely enough ships. Transport the sixth Stratikos. Stratos. Stratikos leads the Stratos. Wait, shouldn't we? Yeah, okay, there we go. Mr. Ship. Good enough. A Puli out of revolting. Oh, whoops. No, I missed the ship there. Okay, well, we can take care of a Puli. Finally got the barbarians up. But we have to move here to block them. Encourage this. Good. Successful colony. Oh, they're actually heading back that way. Or are they heading into Rome territory? Okay. I block them here. Yeah, they managed to get some reinforcements from Navari. That's fine. Just means more barbarians for us. And it seems like Rome colonizes that. I guess that was all that was really stopping them, was that there was barbarians in the province, huh? <sighs> Slave rising spreads. And the boats... Freaking barb, freaking everything. Ugh. Christ. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Retreat. Retreat. Holy shit. We've been guaranteed by Rome. Yeah, after that loss, I'm not surprised. There is now 28 regiments in Crete. 
I can't take that. <laughs> like, I can't take that. I, 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 I can't. That's not gonna happen. Oh dear. Uh, so things we want. We want that, and we want this. There. Okay. Good. Go. We definitely need Carthage's help. Uh, no, okay, we send them a gift here. It's been a few years. 14, good. Don't send gifts so rapidly. Like, give three years apart, we'll say. But, uh, our relationship is improving. We might just barely manage it. Good, yeah, you're, you're a good envoy. We'll need you. We might just barely, if we're lucky, manage an alliance here. Does the emergency entrance be allowed to pass through our land? Yeah, sure, whatever. That's fine. Uh, allied with Egypt. Mm -hmm. I mean, a war with Rome is obviously drawing near. Like, it's, it's pretty obviously going to be a war with Rome at some point. Like, I, I can't stop it. There's, n there's no way I can stop it. I'm just trying to think, like, what can I do to improve my odds? Roma has probably more troops than I do. I really need Carthage, yeah. Oh, well, that'll do it for today, though. Thank you, everybody, for watching. This has been your lovely host, Calvin, signing off.